Mila Entertainment TV. Today is the 20th of uh, November uh, 2022. Remember guys to like, share, comment and follow and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that you do upload here. So guys, uh, today I'm not feeling well. So I'm not sure I'm sick of my voice. But anyway, uh, here's the latest news guys. Um, local government and public works minister Julia Moyo has appointed a full member tribunal to probe the allegations of misconduct against six suspended Ashtungiza municipality triple c councillors when you said that you with a municipality would be at the cost of the inquiry the councillors are former mayor love more michael former deputy mayor musa makweza triple c chief whip richard chamuta peter materenge kudakwashi john and chingetai nyangodo the six were suspended on 10 october after they convened an illegal meeting on the 7th of october where michael was reinstated as mayor Chitungiza has been without a mayor since March this year when Michael was recalled by the Douglas Monzola led MDCT. Efforts to hold elections to replace Michael failed to take place since March after Harare Provincial Affairs and Devolution Secretary Tavazo Mugut, acting mayor Kevin Mutimba Nyoka, and more recently, the NPF councillor Reginald Mashinga approached the High Court to block the move. The councillors, however, went ahead and re elected Michael on October 7, leading to their arrest for convening an illegal council meeting. Mr. Moyo said the tribunal to investigate the triple C councillors will be chaired by advocate Rachel Shibaya. Moyo wrote, pursuant to the suspension in terms of Section 104A of the Local Government Laws Amendment of 2016, I hereby appoint you as a member of a tribunal to look into allegations of misconduct levelled against the councillors. The other members of the tribunal are local government board member Ahmad Dishe Chinyangetere, Ministry of Local Government's Principal Administrative Officer Leonard Kuposa, Corporate Lawyer Yuda Ndawana, and the Public Service Commission's Commissioner Ozias Owe. So, guys, that's the latest here. I mean, uh, Julia Moyo has been a, I would say, a man who has been doing a lot uh, for the last year or two and against. Uh, my councillors. I mean, it seems like there's an hidden agenda against Triple C councillors, whether it's Arari, Chitungwiza, which ones are going to be suspended, one, you know, a reinstate, or a suspend, as a carry, and a court of corruption, you know, they just be back and forth. I mean, we've seen it happening so many times. Yeah, on Arari councillors, Triple C councillors. As I didn't have any ZNPF councillors, I didn't suspend or whatsoever, but we're going to the Triple C councillors. So, uh, these councillors, are they corrupt? Can I tell uh, punish the guilty guy behind closed doors. We really don't know because uh, every time touch ones on the my triple C councillors are suspended. A B C D and so uh, I I feel like uh, next year uh, Wacha Misa needs to do a very a proper search for my councillors uh, who really wants to work for the people. Because some of these guys my councillors are angwa angwa chuzao ah wanango asina ah chokuita ne kuta councillor. I know what you my picks and you know what you do my deals and everything like that. So, uh, you know, we need people who really want to work for the people. And uh, quite a to one who I cancel her because uh, you know he is popular, but when it comes uh, to the job on the ground, I panaja nanga achita. So, I told my counselors, when you can't kushanda, my counselors, uh, they really, really, really um, hold the uh, office with integrity, not kungo the counselor with triple C, or to it a madira ko and also chema victim kana. So we have heard enough. When there's smoke, there's fire. So I hope that uh, this time Triple C will vet their council candidates. If my council and Katanga are both vet office, are they really, really want to be councillors? Are they willing to uh, work for the community? Can I go to? I go to councillor because I go to the community. 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 I mean. Because I've seen a lot of uh, things happening in the past whereby I mean there should be a criteria to choose my counselor so we hope that uh, this time uh, it's gonna be a very very um, transparent way of vetting uh, my candidates for next year uh, for councils for MPs this is a daily news breaking news everyday news on Prince Milan Entertainment TV remember to like share comment and follow bless up